Hello everyone, this is episode 5. It's, uh, well, it's my favorite episode because, uh, oh, here's the thing. Every time I make a video, there's always a key scene that I imagine first. Uh, it's something that I see at the beginning of the project. And everything I do, everything I write down on the script has to lead to this scene somehow. This scene might not be the end, it could be in the middle anywhere. And yeah. And uh, that's the scene is in this video, and it turned out all right. Uh, it turned out the way I wanted to look. Uh, oh, yeah, close. Because you know, when you imagine something, it always looks better than the uh, something that you actually make. But here, yeah, I come pretty close to what I imagined, so I was really happy. Um, because that scene is the scene where Jacko Chan dies. Uh, that's the scene where. Um, because he's a bad person. I mean, if you're homicide, incest, pedophilia, you you deserve a gruesome death. Um, the adult rating of this entire miniseries can come to this one point. Uh, of course, of course, gore and stuff doesn't compares nothing to you know, uh, ideas and theories that you talk about. Uh, shadows of paper, doors, glue, glue taxi, to be first Now here's the uh, locked monster. His, his face is like a locked cage, is what I want to make it look like. And he's locked, so uh, he's trapped in this. That's the symbolism. He's trapped in Sonic Hill. Much like uh, the main character feels like you know, most characters do, they feel like they're trapped here. Um, because he, like, if, like in the previous episode, he doesn't like hospitals because he thinks that's like a trap as well. He's trying to save this girl that he always sees in the trapped corridor. Um, yeah, he's a background on why Jamaica is related to Silent Hill. Yeah, it needs to be explained, of course. There's some magic TV effects there. The TV turns up and turns on again. I still don't know why the twins won't oh. go. Sometimes they seem so different. Uh, but yeah, uh, this is a video that was. Uh, Obviously, during editing, the, everything in the TV is going to have to be exported first. I think I'll go wake up and put it. back in, kind of thing. Because uh, I don't have like millions of gigs of RAM. But yeah, that, that, that gruesome scene in this episode is the first thing I saw when I did. When I thought about, yes, I want to do a Silent Hill Lego video. It's a spiritual uh, yeah. sequel to Jenny? Resident Jenny. Evil uh, Lego video. Because they're both uh, my favourite horror games. I mean, it's not horror anymore, uh -huh. but it used to be. And Silent Hill was also a survival horror, and the camera angles are usually quite similar in both games when you're in tight corridors and stuff. Um, and to me, Silent Hill vs. Evil compare closely to each other. I like the sister games um, to me. You know. No, I still don't find this big boss once again. This time is, I can't remember what I named this thing, but um, basically he is much like the lost creature that Stephen was fighting earlier. He's like an extreme version, basically down with spears hung all over the place. Uh, yeah, Lego has barbed wire pieces. They're for kids. <laughs> get them from the agent sets, uh, the agent theme that came out a few years ago. Here's the thing, I'm not that good in making combat with Lego figures. That's why the boss fights are short, but with all of them I'm trying to find a unique way for all of them to happen. Like, it's a bitch. unique way of, them, of him fighting them. Mine. Yeah, there's a uh, piece of no, no. that seat there that I removed. <laughs> it's a bit silly. Fuck. Fuck it's, it's a Silent Fuck Hill you. devil seat thing. Ooh. <laughs> And, and every time I film toy dolls, I always have like lying figures in the background. Because I'm probably making a big TV. Like, oh no, there's actually no monsters walking around. Which is what happens in Silent Hill 2. You can't, no. beyond the fog, You're there's always something walking around. I killed all of you. Yeah, and these children here are actually yeah. all the children that he molested yeah. and Ricky. killed. Uh, as for which order he did I those things, so that's up for you to imagine. Yeah, I want to think of the most gruesome things here. Clean out someone's guts and then their genitals. It's, it's the most, it's one of the most disgusting things I can think of. Uh, and yeah, actually, she's got a bit of brown and red paint on that leather plate there, which uh, I haven't washed off yet. 
but I have clean photo. You can get to see that in the uh, university video as well, I can see it in line as well. Yeah, I did have uh, paint all over that mini thing. Uh, Herman had uh, passing out judgment like it should be, and the Wilhelm skin. So I tend to use that in most of my videos. I only don't use that Wilhelm screen if I forget. So it's near the end of the video, and yeah, that was the scene that I was happy with. Uh, and more line figures there, and I'll see you guys in the next episode.